And we're back for more Mystery Case Files. Key to Ravenhurst, I'm your Gibbs. Let's get into this. Number 12 in the series. You know, I was actually checking my notes and I actually have recorded the fifth Mystery Case Files, which is, I think, the second Ravenhurst game. Anyways, you can always check that out. There'll be the link in the video description for that playthrough as well. Look at the water droplets just dripping away here. Now, I did try to shoot my loaded flare gun, and uh, we got a cool uh, animation in the last episode there, which I think is kind of clever. We're going to go over here and use it where we're supposed to, which is with all our beautiful cravens here. Yeah, we need to add amateur scarecrow, amateur scarecrow, to our resume. <laughs> Clever. So a few of you are asking about, is the detective a girl or a boy? And I have already commented on that. They've already captured that in a previous a Mr. Case Files game. I detective, think. look beyond the fog. What is beyond the fog? Good question. Barker, no! I could have saved him if not for those bloody cravens. And here's one over here. That would be a collectible. And uh, if you have anything happening, if you're watching and you happen to see that I missed one, just go ahead and shout that out in the comments. Thank you very much. So we've got a nice full moon over here. Let's go and check out what happened to Agent Barker. Oh no. His body lay twisted and broken on the coastline. What a grim way to go. This looks fantastic. Man, I want to go back to the beach. I really like the beach. Rather unusual decorations for a vial of plain medical solvent. Did Barker's attacker drop this? Good question. Okay, I need to go here for a second. I'm not sure if it's the effect sound. There we go. Maybe just kind of it's so thundery and lightning right now. A piece of his raincoat. If only I had been here earlier. Yes, indeed. Let's go here. Oh, dominoes. The cottage had a similar padlock the last time I was here. A feeling of deja vu haunts me. There's our domino. Despite being criticized to the point of ostracization by the members of the Royal Science Academy and General Academia, I must persist in my theories. The well of evidence I've accumulated over my years of research and investigation tells a tale riddled with darkness and magic. Lost history of England sounds like fiction disguised as scientific research. At least the man is persistent. These symbols must hold some significance. I had better commit them to a memory. Okay. Sounds like a plan to me. Hey, who's there? Whoa, we nearly fell into that, didn't we? Just a step more and I'd have fallen into my death. Fortunately, I'm quick on my feet. Typewriter keys. Look at this scarf. Look at that physics there. Look at that fabric going on. Ooh, there's something among those thorny branches. Ouch, ouch, ouch. So I don't think I have much to do with that yet. No. Ew, we got something gooey over here. I'll have to remove this resin with something strong, like a metal brush. No. Solvent. Yeah, get away from there, solvent. It's a heart. A mannequin heart. Look at those tentacles. I'm not a mechanic, but this seems like a strange way to activate the bridge. My instincts tell me that that shadowy figure I wished for a sudden end to my investigation. Oh, oh, wait a minute. We gotta find the craven over here. Might oh, there it is. Found you. So we have the mannequin heart. Let's go and put that back inside of our dear old mannequin here. Oops, wrong spot. 
the heart brought life to the mannequin. Luckily, only for a short time. That is a very cre creepy looking face. Makes me think of Michael. Uh, you may wonder what I mean by that. Michael Myers? Does not look like Michael Myers' mask. I'm sure some of you know what I'm talking about. Vibrator keys and a fishing rod. So we should be able to go over here and fish for gold here. Well. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who's dragging him away? Who's dragging that body? That's not good. It appears I'm not alone in this area. Judging by their actions, they can't be friendly. But they're by the beach. Whoa! Grab those gloves. Yeah! Now we can get past those brambles. Parker was right, Ravenhurst has risen from the ashes. Though not like I remember it though. You can select the edges of the scene like this one to see further. Uh, sure. Oh I see, there we go. The fog is all gone. Let's have another look again. Look at how they've built this, like, that feels scary to me. I don't know if I would really like to be living on the side of a mountain like that. Yikes. Alright, let's get in here and get whatever that is. Domino, maybe? Yes, it is. Domino away. Look at that boat over there. Hmm. So we're going to have to figure out how to get this operational. A shipwreck lies in the coastline. Its proximity to the manor makes my detective senses tingle. Like I've been bitten by a spider. Alrighty then. Information? Find all the given dominoes on the central board. Ah, I remember this from the beta. This one took me a little while to solve. But, uh... Nonetheless, we're all set here. See, that can't be there. Nope, so that's gotta be like that. And then what else do we got? Nope, so that's gotta be like this. Done! I think I did that a lot quicker the second time around. Whoa! Look at this! The art looks fantastic. I'm sorry, but I love how the tree is swaying, like the branches are moving around here. It looks fantastic. And even just the... Ugh, so good. This is an interactive HOP. Find the objects in the scene based on the silhouettes in your inventory. Plunger. Let's go plunge up the place. Hmm. We, uh, we need a code here. We need something. Oh, maybe we can use this. Nope. Uh, I might be able to break the doors with a slender piece of metal. Like a crowbar. You know it. I know it. Victor's favorite junk. Okay. Apparently we gotta find all this stuff here. Ooh, look at those fancy pliers. That reminds me, I gotta buy new tools. I'm moving into a new house, and uh, I'm gonna purge some of my older tools and buy some nice new ones. Mostly because I have a lot of tools that I don't use anymore. When I moved into my current house, I built the basement from the ground up. So yeah, I had a lot of like legacy tools that I'll never need in my new house because my new house is being fully completed by the builder. Everything. Everything will be completed. I'll have a few minor things that I will have to do, 
but uh, all the heavy lifting will be done by the builder, and I'm super excited about that. So I don't need all those tools that I used to have, or that I do have. So what am I looking for? I'm looking for probably chisel. Yeah, there we go. VD, Victor Dalmar. What do you have hiding in your chest, mister? Now we have something going on there. That might be what we need a crowbar for. Hmm. So I have a plunger. I have to stop it. Now I can plunge it. There we are. And now I have a mallet. Hmm. Last time I saw this much junk was in a graveyard. So I have a V somewhere and some oil. Uh, I still need the code somehow. So I still need lock parts somewhere. Dolly, dolly, what if I do this? Yeah, get in there. Mallet it up. A box cutter. Four, five, six, two. Four, five, six, two. Crowbar. Oh my lord, look at how beautiful that crowbar is. All shiny and delicious. I mean, shiny and handsome. How can a crowbar be delicious, Gibbs? That's just crazy. But they can be handsome. Yeah, and beautiful too. Don't forget that. Let's see what Victor had hiding in here. Oil for days. So I have a box knife and rust remover. Hmm. Rust might go here, maybe? Yep. And there's the lock piece. That, oh, I need one out of. Sorry, I only need one more. Hmm. So we have a box cutter. What could we cut? Oh, we probably can cut the net. Now we have our drawer. Drawer tile. Drawer tile. So, middle one is fixed. So we can try and maybe do this. this over here, I think. I think we got it. Yeah! Beautiful. Corkscrew and a heart. Let's find out what's in here. It's a heart. Mr. Heart, what do you want to do? I got my luck parts. Ask me a question. Oh, that's our reward, a beautiful axe. Okay, let's see what else is, I bet you we can use our axe right here. Oh, no, maybe not. Whoa, we just broke right into it. We have our typewriter keys. And we have something in here, sun. You know how fond I am of educational presence, and I trust you will put this to good use. Do not let your wonderful talent for violence go to waste. Your father, Charles. Charles has very bizarre ideas about parenting. <gasps> it's a boxing glove gun thing. Yes. I want to use that everywhere. So... I'm not sure how, what else I can do here. Hmm. Alright, let's box up the place here. I'm gonna go over here. Can I do something here? No. Hmm. What about here? Axe? No? What if I use the axe on here, no? Hmm. 
Whoa, let's box up these doggies. No. Not interested. So I'm pretty sure we're gonna have to start the fire. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. We can go back to the car. Let's get out of here. Let's blow this popsicle stand. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 wait. Hang on, hang on. Yeah. Love it. So. Oh. Rope. I think that might work down here, actually. The bars will give in to some twisting and turning, but I need a piece of metal. Apparently that's not what I need there. What if we bash this in? It seems like a silly idea in the first place, but at least I tried. Yeah, that was totally legit. So there's another example where they've added that extra animation or something that clearly is not the right saw. <laughs> nice. Now, let's see what the new owner has tried to hide beyond this poor excuse for a fence. Whoa, the sight of these reconstructed Ravenhurst gates brings chilling memories to mind. Mm-hmm. What are we gonna do about these gates? Wow, the Craven was hiding in there. A code for the intercom. Quite paranoid. The new proctor. Okay. Oh my. What in the world is this going on about? The face of the statue seems to be locked in eternal misery. That doesn't sound good at all. Nobody likes eternal misery. Can we punch it? I want to punch it now. Aww. Hmm. So what else can we do here? I've got this metal brush. Looks like I need something in her belly there. R for Ravenhurst. So what else can I do? Hmm. Oh, such luck. Wait a minute, do I actually have a map? I do have a map, let's check it out. Ooh, nifty. Active objective. Your current location. I do have something to do here, apparently. Okay. I could deal with that. Hmm. Looks like there should be something over here, this side. Well, this is all I have in inventory, so... Apparently I gotta do something back here. Uh, do I know this code? Oh, I just gotta brute force it? Okay. Heart. Okay, so... Heart. Club. Heart, club, diamond. Heart, club, heart. A good evening, and welcome to the Ravenhurst Museum. With whom am I speaking? I'd like you to ask the same question. Benedict, tell them to come back another time. We're closed. Surely this was a conversation filled with the foundation of Ravenger's eternal love. <laughs> Whoa, what's going on back here? Ah, I bet you can use our adhesive tape. Yeah, we're gonna get in this- Whoa! Holy cow, you lady, you've surprised me. My apologies, but the museum is not yet open to guests. We're in the final stages of construction. It's no place for someone who doesn't remember history. Ah, uh, that feels like a dig to me. That was a rather cryptic conversation. 
But if she doesn't want to let me in, I will find my own way. Yeah, we're gonna do this whether she likes it or not. 